back down at the Bear Hawk booth where they've got all three models on display here, uh, including the really nice four place uh, behind me here that belongs to a customer. Um, that's been finished off really, really nicely. So I'll grab Mark, who's the owner of the company, to give us a run through on each of the models. I'm uh, Mark, Bearhawk Aircraft. We manufacture kits for three models of airplanes, the Bearhawk LSA, the Bearhawk Patrol, and the Bearhawk 4 Place. Uh, I'm standing here by the uh, Bearhawk LSA, uh, talking with Richard. All of the three models have very similar design features because they were designed by the same engineer, Bob Barrows of Virginia. He's a very well-known, highly regarded design engineer, and I've been flying his airplanes for close to 20 years and uh, couldn't think more highly of them. And the truth is, nobody that flies in any of his airplanes comes away uh, anything other but very impressed. They all fly very good, all three models. So this LSA is our smallest model, and unlike most of the LSAs that are out there, this is a serious, rugged airplane. The tubing is thick, uh, it uses a conventional aircraft engine, a Continental O200 is what I have in mind, and I see speeds of 120 miles an hour, a touchdown speed and ground effect of about 30 miles an hour, and it's really a sweet flying little plane. Everybody who I turn loose in this airplane, my friends, they, uh, everybody loves it. Uh, so I, uh, I really think you'd uh, enjoy it if you're thinking about a light airplane to maybe replace an Aronka, a Taylor Craft, those old Cubs, uh, this is a great option. Uh, all three designs have a lot of the same design features. They're steel tube structures, beefy steel tube structures, all aluminum wings, completely flush riveted, driven rivets without a round head rivet in the breeze anywhere, which is the lightest, strongest, and least drag way to build a wing. Uh, it is more expensive for us to manufacture than pop riveted wings, but it's a uh, an airplane that will be there for your grandchildren uh, a long time from now. They're very rugged and uh, last a long time. I'm standing by the Bearhawk Patrol now, a two-place tandem model. That was the second uh, airplane kit that we developed. The four-place Bearhawk was the first. Uh, it has many common features to all the others. The, one of the features that I should mention is the shock strut, the landing gear. It's an oil-dampened spring shock which is very, very forgiving. If you drop it in, it sticks. It doesn't bounce you back in the air like a spring gear or bungees. So we really like it, and it, uh, pilots have found it's a, great, it's a great landing gear that's extremely forgiving. This one is sort of comparable to the PA-18s that are so well regarded in the world, but it compares very favorably in a lot of ways. It's a six inch wider cockpit, which is very comfortable. It's not cramped, it's easy to get in and out of. And probably one feature that gets their attention, the Super Cub owners is, this is a 155 mile an hour cruise airplane with the constant speed prop, as opposed to 100, 110, 90 mile an hour airplane in the old Cubs with, that are draggy and have a very slow airfoil. Uh, if you think about that kind of airplane, you should consider our Bearhawk Patrol. Now I'm standing by the Bearhawk 4 Place, which was the first kit that we put in production back in 2001. It's a great flying airplane. Uh, there's not a lot of 4 Place home builds, and in the bush plane kind of world for the short takeoff and landings and the guys that hunt and fish, want to camp out with their families, the ranchers that want to land out in the pastures by their cattle, this is a really good option. It has a cruise speed uh, with a fixed pitch prop over 140 miles an hour and over 155 with a constant speed prop. A uh, lot of room, uh, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of them flying now. There's a, almost 150 Bearhawk four-place airplanes flying out there, and again, everybody loves them. Common design features with the other models, but it's uh, for the, if you have a family, more than just two seats is your need. This is a great airplane for you to consider. They can be built from 180 to 250 to 60 horsepower. The bigger engines provide very exhilarating takeoff and climb, while the smaller engines are very adequate and you have a little more useful load. These planes uh, feature a gigantic cargo door in the back, which is 
really useful for loading all this stuff. You know, when these guys go out in the four-place Bearhawk with their buddies and the Cubs, and these are the guys that take the ice chests and all the gear that makes camping out in the country uh, very, very uh, useful. So you can see here how big this opening is. Tremendous amount of gear that can be put in this airplane. I did a little video once that showed unloading my Bearhawk and I basically filled up the back of my pickup truck with what you can fit in the back of this airplane. Uh, but the main thing is it's a spectacular flying airplane as people see when they get demo flights. And if you need a four place tailwheel airplane, this is a great option.